Double soup with my kid, mommy on Root, that don't be with all that drama. Nah. Money, my business, I'm bothered. I'm bothered. I ain't dragging them. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Getting ready for our dolphin cruise. safety requirements we need to go over. There's no smoking on the boat, no standing on top of the seats or sitting on the railings of the boat. Also in the likely event that we do need them, we do have live jackets and they're behind me in the upper blue compartments marked for the children and the adults. But today your crew, my name is Captain Bill, to my left is Captain Stamonte. If you guys have any questions or need anything, don't be afraid to ask. We do have a snack bar aboard the boat and we have an assortment of sodas, water, and alcoholic beverages. We also have a couple of restrooms, they're all the way in the back. Now today we're going to be traveling along the Inklo River. It's going to be about four nautical miles before we reach our destination out into the Gulf of Mexico. On the way we're going to show you some points of interest. Tarpy Springs does have four major industries. We have fishing, shrimping, sponging, and we have crabbing. All our boats go out between three and four weeks at a time, except for our crab boats. They go out on a daily basis and they go out for stone crab. They bring back just the claws and they put the rest of the crab back in to regenerate those claws. Stone crab is a resourceable food and also a delicacy in the state of Florida. If you've never had it, I highly recommend it. Very tasty. Tarpy Springs also is one of the busiest ports as far as boat repair goes. We have a lot of skilled craftsmen in the area and people from all over the west coast of Florida will bring their boats in here to get repaired. They're called Atlantic bottlenose dolphin. Once they're born here, they spend their entire lives up to about a six dollar mile area. When they're fishing, they can hold their breath about seven minutes. They can eat about 25 pounds of fish in a day. And when they want to, they can get up to speeds about 18 miles per hour. Here to my left, we're gonna be passing a series of islands that are all man-made. In 1887, when Tarpy Springs was incorporated, the way it got its name, there's a kingfish called a tarpon that comes through this river between the months of June, July, and August. And also our bayous are full of spring.
say bye everybody. Bye, bye. bye you too. Bye.